Oh, good morning, West Texans, all you good, fine, friendly folks out there who wish you were. Ryan Hyatt, 60 seconds of Raider Land, our daily commentary, and it usually lasts more than 60 seconds. So that's the way it goes. We're talking Red Raider baseball. Easy winners yesterday over Stephen F. Austin. Why not? He's been dead over 150 years. Jeez, seems like you're picking on the weak ones, and you actually are. Texas Tech right now has an RPI problem. D1Baseball.com, the best source for RPI in baseball. Basically, the NCAA looks at that, and that's how they do their seating. That's Tech at 71. You were 65 before you played Stephen F. That's how bad they are. The math right now, not good for Texas Tech, but things can change, and they could change in a big way this weekend. Texas Tech fans may not realize how big a series this is against UCF from an RPI standpoint. They're great at home. They had the number one strength of schedule in RPI and uh, non-conference play, and they've got an eight RPI right now. I think that's inflated by the math, but it doesn't matter because we're all about math over the next month or so for this Texas Tech team. Numerous opportunities in the Big 12 to go win games against teams that are ranked higher than you in the RPI. we got a lot of different components and things that are happening right now. It's still a little early. There's still some wonkiness to the numbers. But it gets a little bit later every day. And Texas Tech hasn't been this far down in the RPI since about 2015. At this point in the season, and if you know your numbers, uh, well, you know that's the last year that Texas Tech did not make the NCAA tournament. There's work to do, but they've got an opportunity to do it. Tonight on the Daily Broadcast, we'll talk about the challenges of non-conference scheduling for Texas Tech right now and really everybody else and how a schedule that could have looked good six months ago looks like dog meat when you get to the season. I want to hear from you, so uh, sound off, post your comments below, share this on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. We appreciate you guys being out there. Ryan Hyatt, we'll see you tonight, 6.30.